any research on. The rest, I think that I have, I'm aware of people. And I met a lot of Parkinson disease, pe uh, Alzheimer people, and what I discovered that their eyes are very vacant. They don't have any expression in their eyes. And that was very difficult. So I started walking on the beach, and every time I was aware, because people were saying hello, and I was aware of myself, I can't swim. So one day, early morning at 6 o'clock in the morning, I decided to walk into the sea. And for a friction of a second, I l lost that and I discovered, felt that, oh, I did not know who I was. But what was the downside of that film? After that film, every time I forget something, I feel first signs of Alzheimer's. <laughs> first signs of no, Alzheimer's. But that was a very difficult scene because I was also the producer. I could not, I did not, I don't also like the luxury of staying in the character, then forgetting everything. I think it's important to switch on and switch off. And uh, that's, uh, that's one character that I think I really worked very hard. That's all. Thank you. Wonderful, wonderful to hear uh, your experiences on that. As far as that vacant look is concerned, I think, I mean, you can see it on TV anchors every night, politicians, you know, that look of like, what did I say a few years ago? Amul Gupte. You tell us your experience, your story. One can um, see it in a three-pronged way. Uh, one is uh, cinema itself. So cinema itself frightened my pants off me because I was all of three and a half and they were projecting Laurel and Hardy in the Ganet Ganpati Utsav. And Everybody was laughing and I was shrieking with fear because here were these two guys hitting each other and climbing over each other and I said, what is happening here? As a child, I remember complete fright for the medium, though I was exposed to uh, musical theatre of Marathi uh, much before that. So that was first fright. Next time, a milestone happened for me was uh, when Subhashji's Guruji and you know unfolded himself in the main theatre of the Film Institute, and that was with Meghita Katara. With Meghita Katara, I think it was a life changer for me because I couldn't reconcile with the truth that for nearly two hours after the film had finished. I could not stop my tears. I said, this is something which is, which is changing the subterrane of my thought. And this is something that one should try and achieve in life. That it should pierce deeply into people's hearts and minds, if you were to present something. So I guess that is, that is where I stopped. And I still refresh myself with one more viewing of Megheta Katara. And one more tumble of tears, you know. You, you keep watching it again and again? Yes. And is there any other film that ever stirred you in that, in that way since then? No, not one, many. There is uh, Acharya Atre's Sham Chiai, which is an important film, the first president's gold medal. But many, I mean, it's, if you, uh, you know, at one point in life, uh, Anand worked with the death scene, but later when I saw it 